This video talks about a 65-year-old woman with severe sensory neural hearing loss undergoes surgical placement of a cochlear implant. This neural prosthesis converts sound energy to electrical signals, which results in stimulation of which of the following structures. Now, before we even um, explore the options, let's talk about how a cochlear imp implant really work. So I have two pictures over here. Uh, the first one is showing a cochlear implant in a baby from the outside and the second one is kind of showing how the cochlear implant kind of works. Um, going to the next picture, so this is a more um, specific, I guess a little more uh, clear in terms of um, information. So anyways, uh, there is going to be a receiver in a cochlear implant which is going to be outside so this is what, where it's going to start the receiver is going to receive information and it's going to bring the information in the cochlea and the receiver is going to wound around the cochlea like that okay it's going to wound around the cochlea the receiver is going to send impulse through the scala tympani and directly and this information is then taken to the brain so this is what i have written here that the electrode wound through the cochlea send impulse to the nerve in the scala tympani directly to the brain and through the auditory system. So that's how a cochlear implant works. It takes information to the cochlea and from the cochlea to the brain. So the question says, 65-year-old woman with severe sensory neural he hearing loss undergoes surgical placement of a cochlear implant. The neural prosthesis converts the sound energy to electrical signals, results in stimulation of which of the following structures. A, auditory nerve endings in the cochlea. Sure, that sounds like a viable answer. Cochlear nerve as it enters the pons. No, pons and cochlea, you know, the implant doesn't even come close to the pons, so that's not a not a possible answer. Inner hair cells of the cochlea? No, that's not where the implant really goes. But the question also says that which of the following does the cochlea stimulate, right? Stimulation. Results in stimulation of which of the following structures. So it really stimulates the nerve endings in the cochlea. What about inner hair cells of the cochlea? No, it does not stimulate the inner hair cells of cochlea. Olivocochlear efferent axons that innervate the Outer hair cells, this does not even make sense. Oval window of the cochlea, no, it bypasses the oval window, goes straight to the cochlea. So in this case, the correct answer is going to be A, auditory nerve endings in the cochlea because the implant is kind of a wounding around the cochlea, sending impulse to the cochlea from cochlea to the brain.